Hi, I'm Nancy with Factory Direct Craft. Today we're making these hair clip pins that look like pinwheels. What you're going to need is two colors of felt, some small wood stars, some acrylic paint for the stars, the alligator hair clips, hot glue, scissors, ruler, and a pen. Get all those things together and we'll get started on this project. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is paint the stars. Now I'm going to just do one here. I'm going to do one in white. But I also did, for mine, I did them in red, white, and blue. So we'll let this one dry. I've got some all painted already over here. I'm going to wash my hand off. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do after that while the stars are drying is we're going to cut the felt. And the felt, you need two colors in three inch squares. So I have one marked on here already. I measured it out. Trace it out. And if you're going to make a bunch of these, all a bunch of these, I would cut all your squares out at the beginning, get it all done. And you need uh, two squares per hair clip in two different colors, just like this. Okay. And now what you do next is you're going to make cuts into the squares to make the pinwheel look and it needs to be an inch and a half in. So what I have done, I'm, I made a little square an inch and a half in, so where, where it was. And so now all I have to do is center that and I make little dots at each spot there and then here and you could also make a square that size and cut out the center and then just trace inside that either way you can do whatever you prefer but I did it like that and then I just cut in straight from the corner to the little mark I made This one too. These are going to look so cute on the little girls. Fourth of July picnic. Okay, I got the squares all cut. This one, let's see. Maybe I'll put the red on the outside this time. Okay, now I line that on top of each other, whichever way you want, can go either way. And what I'm going to do now, is I'm gonna use my hot glue gun, and I'm gonna bring these corners in. And how I'm gonna do it is I'm gonna take every other corner into the center and glue it down. And I found what you do so that you don't get glue all over the place. It just works better. Do one at a time. One layer at a time. See, I take that layer down. And then I'm going to take the red square, put glue on that. And just fold that in. And hold it there for a second. Do you feel it's firm? And then I skip over to here. I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to come and meet that one, okay? Put glue on the first layer. In. Hold it down. While you're holding that down, go ahead and put the glue on the next layer. Bring it in. Hold that down. And you just keep going around your pinwheel here. And you can see it's starting to appear. 
Whoops, that one's coming back up. Try to get that straight then. There we go. A little bit more. Oh my, gotta try to keep that square there. That's okay. Try to keep that excess glue off. And a little bit more. It's the last one then. take a star let's see what which one do I want oh maybe I'll do the white one on there okay and then I'm just gonna put glue on the back of the star and if you have any uneven spots like I kind of did there it doesn't matter because that star covers where it all came together just like that I want to make sure that's holding good before I flip this over. Now I need my hair clip. There we go. I'm going to get all the extra glue off while it's still easy to get off. Okay. Then I'm going to glue this on here just like this. Let's see. I think it's like this they go actually. Let me see. Yeah, like that. Okay, so I'm going to just run glue down the back of this. And stick it on. Hold it down good so it's not going anywhere. Let it get hard. And... There you go. Pinwheel hair clip. Really cute. Thanks for watching today.